Dozens of shots fired in a Prattville neighborhood tonight. WSFA 12 News is targeting crime. Police looking for the people responsible. It happened late Sunday night. WSFA 12 News anchor Sally Pitt spoke today with the city's chief of police and mayor. The latest on their investigation and efforts to keep that neighborhood safe. We're going to do everything we can to uh, get you locked up. Prattville Police Chief Mark Thompson is sending a strong message to those who fired more than 50 shots in his city over the weekend. Chief Thompson says homes were hit along Cosby Court and in the Bentry area. We had several houses hit by gunfire in that neighborhood. Um, a gas line was hit on one of those houses. I feel like we're very, very fortunate that no one was physically hurt. Mayor Bill Gillespie lives not far from where the shots were fired. He says the city has invested a lot of money in technology to help solve crimes like this, but he says it's going to take everyone working together to make Prattville safer. He's calling on the community to speak up. He says, see something, say something. Report something, and through that, they can be the force multiplier for our, for our first responders, our police department. He is confident Chief Thompson and his team will find those responsible. We're not going to tolerate it. Chief Thompson and his crew are going to be on top of it. But Gillespie and the chief are concerned about the number of young teens committing crimes. The kids have no, uh, they don't care the ones doing this. They don't have sympathy. They don't have any morals when they do it, and they go end up hurting somebody or killing somebody. Chief Thompson also believes his investigators will catch those who fired the shot Sunday night. He says his department is committed to going after criminals. They recently helped other departments make arrests. Thompson says if you live in Prattville and commit a crime in another city, his team will do all they can to lock you up. Sally Pitts, WSFA 12 News.